It's become all many drivers can think about right now. Gas prices in Northeast Ohio just keep going up and up. And in Cuyahoga County alone, the average price of gas is 408 a gallon. That's just a penny more than the statewide average price of gas. Now, about a week ago, the average price of gas in Ohio was 399. So what does the future at the pump look like? And how are people adjusting to record high prices? News 5 anchor DeLon Dillard spoke with those who believe the future of these prices is unclear. Another trip to the gas station, another headache for drivers. The cause, y'all know by now, these sky high gas prices. 63 today used to be about 35 to 40. So I'm paying a lot more for gas. Prices are through the roof and it's unclear when they'll come down. Brandon Speck usually drives a diesel truck. I don't barely drive anywhere anymore unless I have to. Tuesday, he was filling up his wife's SUV, but his own truck is sitting at home untouched. Pretty frustrating to have to double the money and just not be able to do anything and it's it sucks. I went directly to AAA East Central about this. Experts say the Ohio average jumped nine cents within the past week and 84 cents within the past month. For reference, that's an extra 10 bucks for an average small car's 12 gallon fill up, double that for a large truck or SUV. Throughout 2021, crude oil prices were moving upward on the back of uh, different events. And then following the Ukraine Russian invasion, oil prices spiked and they spiked pretty significantly, you know, going from around $100 a barrel up to $125 a barrel. Jim Garrity says we're heading into the summer months, so the future of prices is unclear. We're going into the time of the year where demand increases because more people drive. Uh, summer blend gasoline starts hitting the markets, which is more expensive to produce and more expensive to buy. With that in mind, back at the gas station, drivers like Dan Noel weren't surprised about the price jump. I expected it to go up as soon as all this Ukraine stuff started, but I mean, it is what it is. You, what are you going to do? You're going to pay it no matter what you do. Now, one small way that Dan and so many other drivers are saving a couple coins is by using their fuel rewards. You can find them at Kroger, Meyer, and right here at Shell. You click it, you can either save with your loyalty or your fuel rewards points. But bottom line here, the headache that ensues after grabbing the gas nozzle probably isn't going away just yet. I'll probably drive my wife's car. She's got a little car, so, you know, I will drive that probably to travel in a little bit more than the truck. In Brook Park, DeLon Dillard, News 5. All right, thanks, DeLon. And News 5 is helping you find the least expensive place to fill up your tank. Visit our website. That's news5cleveland.com. Click on the gas prices tab for a list of stations near you. That's where you can also compare the price of gas by county.